Hello everybody and welcome to a new recording of Dragon Warrior Alchemy. I almost forgot what I was going to say there. I've leveled up blue. Um, Tov is now off the leash because we learned a new skill. We learned this hurt spell and the hurt spell is super fucking useful. I was a little surprised they brought back the classic Dragon Warrior 1 hurt spell of all things. But no, it is useful. It hits all enemies. It's amazing. And, um, you know, that's a good experience for Blue. That's how she got all the, got to level 5 already. And with that, I decided, okay, I don't need the leash for now, because if I'm in danger, I could always just... Or if I need experience, I could just use Hurt. At least for now. And it doesn't seem to have an element of infinity, because it seems to hit everybody. But anyway, we're here at the cave that they told us about that will lead us to that tower in the upper right corner. Um, this is just left of a lie hand. It's not that far. And so, let's travel there. Because we need to get a silver key. What kind of enemies we're getting here? Horned rabbits. Alright, I'm just going to show one fight off. Oh, thank you, Tob, for stunning them. I'm not going to use heart on them because it's... This is not too bad. This is something that we could handle. But if it's like a multiple different types, I might do something different. Uh, yeah, I'll skip this. Okay. Yeah, some of the encounters are getting a little too much there. Alright, there's some gonna be some treasures around that we can get. Let's see, we're gonna go... I think it's down first? Uh, okay, I could show this off. The, uh, the frog war is sort of new. Thank you for stunning them. We mostly need some money anyway. Yep, there's some treasure. Uh, you know what? Let's show off the hurt spell, because that's a lot of enemies. Unfortunately, I'm a little slow. But yeah, hits everybody. Extremely awesome. I just gotta try to use it sparingly so I don't drive the cost up too high. We got a medical herb. That's not bad. I'll meet you outside the room. Alright, we're outside the room. Let's go up. Oh my god, really? Yeah, encounter rate's gonna be tough. It, I guess it's to level uh, Bluette up more or something. Alright, we got a treasure chest. I'll meet you right next to it. Okay, and inside this treasure we have... Wayfarer's clothes. Um, the dancer's costume will help with my hurt spell. Let me see. It's three more defense. At the moment I'm okay, I feel. Let's see, and now one of these loops, I don't remember which. I'm gonna go up first. Uh, after these, this fight, anyway. Alright, I'm gonna go up first. Yep, treasure! I'll meet you at the treasure if I get into a fight. Ooh, I didn't! Eight whole gold, really? Mm. And if we go right, it just loops around to the bottom. So we can just go down now. I remember that much, at least. Alright, and now we're in the Tower of Najima, and of course we get into a fight immediately. Well, that fight le uh, leveled me up. That was nice. Let's see, we have two ways to go. I think this way... If I go up, is that the tower, or is that the other place? Let's find out. Ah, this is just to go to the tower. Oh, shit, I shouldn't have gone down. But we got a couple new enemies here. Let's get rid of the Magician first. Alright, at least Tob took the damage okay. Go back in, and let's go right. I want to show up all the paths first. I think this one leads back to the castle. So let's find out. A teleportal. Will that take us to the castle? Ah, just some strange land that we can't get through. Well, that was pointless. I'll meet you back at the uh, crossroad. Okay, let's go up this time. Let's see what's... well, up. <laughs> I think there's some treasures here. Let's try left first. Yay! Treasure! But what could it be? 16 gold. Wow. They really cheapen out here. Alright, what about to the right then? Uh, door I can't get into. I assume that's what the new key will let me go through. And I think that's going to lead us back to the castle. Alright. And yeah. And that's the silver key door. Alright. 
I will meet you back in the side of the tower. Alright, we're in the tower. I got a map for this, so it'll make things a little bit easier. So here we go. We gotta go up. Uh, these first two rooms are blank, according to uh, the map. I'll check them out on my own time, but if, and if there's something in there, I'll let you know. Uh, we want to go to the top left room, because that's apparently going to have an inn. Normally, anyway. So let's see if it still has it, or if they edited it out. Uh, well, they definitely edited it. In? In? Who would put an inn in a place like this? Move along! Okay, thank you for nothing, slime person. Had to check. Well, I have a few medical herbs, so if I really need to, I can heal. At the moment, we're okay. Uh, we're gonna go straight across to the right, but before I do, I'm gonna get into this battle! Uh, I'll meet you across in that room. Alright, we're in the room right across from the not-in. And we also gained a level, so now I know the spell outside! Finally, we have some convenient stuff. Alright, let me scroll down on my map here. Whoop. Uh, let's see... We have a treasure chest. If I go from there to there... Okay, there's two treasure chests if we go north. Oh, this is actually different. Huh. Why is this different? Yeah, they, they changed this up a little bit. Hmm. Well, let's go up first. Okay, which has apparently nothing. Yeah, nothing. Uh, I'm probably going to get into a fight, so I'm going to move to the, the next room to the left. Really, game? <laughs> let's go up. Really? This is different from my map, so I guess I'm going in this blind. Probably gonna get into a battle as soon as I get in, but let's see. Alright. Hmm. Treasure! Okay, what do we got? 20 gold. Eh, could be better. Well, let's see what's in this room. That's the staircase! Is that the right staircase? Well, we're gonna have to find out. Who the hell knows? Okay, yeah, this is the way it would lead on my map. It just, again, slightly different, well, map readout here. Let's see what we got here. According to this, it should be a leather helmet, but first we have a battle, apparently. And in the chest, I can't carry any more items. Great. I'm gonna heal myself. A leather hat. Yay, another one. I got one randomly from a drop. Uh, let me see. I will meet you back at the back at the stairs we first uh, came from to get over here. You'll know what I mean. Right here. That's where. Anyway, we gotta go down and to the far left next. I think that room's empty. Let's see. Ugh, encounters. Anyway, I'll meet you in the left room if there's nothing in the above room. Alright, we're in the left room, and this is very different. I don't know what's in... There's one stair here, but what about up here? Well, we're about to find out. Nothing! Okay, I'll meet you up the stairs. Or... Well, I... Technically, I was right. Uh, I'm gonna avoid any chests for now, and I wanna gonna... Kinda gonna go for... Getting the key immediately. Which, according to this map, should be... If we just hug this wall... We should be able to find it. Yeah, the very first right turn, or south turn. Should be it, but let's find out if they change that. <laughs> One step away, really? Okay, yep, this is the right spot. Let's just talk to the guy, and we're home free. Welcome, I don't recognize you. Are you from these parts? No. Then here's a tip. You should try the food at Louise's place in her life. It's to die for. Let me say yes. Oh, you're from me. I'm sorry to hear about your recent problems there. My guess is that Baramos' minions were looking for a fight at a lion. Got cold feet. I took a swipe at your town out of frustration. 
You do look woeful, and you've got all and you've come all this way. This is all I have to give, though. The silver key. Awesome. Yeah, it made a new spot in my inventory. I want to sell all this for money and get a better weapon. Uh, alright. Um, I'm going to backtrack out of here, sell my shit, come back and pick up the last bit of treasures. So, I'll see you there, but just to show you. It opens! Hooray! Um, yeah, it's, le it's less convenient to go to go all the way out, so I'm just going to hop off here. I'll meet you there. Whee! In we go. Alright, coming back from a lie hen to heal up, we got ourselves the new weapon, the chain sickle. Mostly there for getting uh, better equipment and all. I mean, mostly better for hitting flying enemies, excuse me. But anyway, we have the two treasure chests that we that are down here. Yep, they're still here. Okay, we got the agility seed, which we're immediately going to use on her. She can definitely use to be faster. And a medical herb, okay. I'll meet you back at that, at the floor I, the last floor we were in the Jima Tower. Okay, we're here at the tower. Um, from below is where you'd go and talk to the old man and get the silver key. If you go above, it's just blank space, don't bother going. What we want to do is go to the room to the right. And right down here. And get this treasure chest. Okay, and uh, right. Uh, let me go ahead and use one of the medical herbs I randomly found. We got a wing of wyvern. Nope. And that's all the treasures that you can get in here. Uh, I will meet you back inside the Lion Castle, where we'll open up all the new doors. Alright, this is the jail where we uh, we just came from the tower, from the little secret door there. Let's go ahead and explore all the possible goodies we can get just from having a new key. First up is to the left. Hello, dude. You can break open the seal using the magic bowl. An old man in Reeve can tell you more. Well, that seems important. Also, uh, mm, let's just use that up so I have room again. Yeah, one thing I miss about having party members is, you know, inventory space. We have this dude. Most travel doors transcend worlds. There are four earthly worlds linked by these passages. Want to know more? Sure. Which world are you interested in? There's Alifgard, Alifgard, Torlin, Alterth, and Femora. What's Alterth? Alterth is this world, and Romali is its capital. Oh, Alt Earth. I get it. Okay, yeah, that makes sense because this has a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of similarities to uh, our real world. We also boast such fine kingdoms as this one. Oh, in Portugal, Samano, Nail, Isis, and of course the Shrine of Dama. Want to do more? Alright, Alifgard. Alifgard, with its capital, Tentacle, is the smallest of the worlds, and where the great hero Eldrick hailed from. It's somewhat of a simple place, though. Less finery in the castles, and fewer beds in at the inn. Alright. Uh, Torlin is Dragon Warrior 2, I think, right? Torlin. That is where Moonbrook once stood. Its new capital will, capital will most likely be Kanak, as long as the descendants of Erdrick still live there. That would be Panin, right? And now, what the hell is Fomora? Is Fomora where your Dragon Warrior 4 is from? Hmm. Fomora is the kingdoms Kilion, Berlin, Santim, and Endor, its capital. The travel door to the east of here leads to a secluded valley in Fomora. Hmm, okay. Want to know more? I'm good. As long as you know the worlds that make up existence. Very good. I don't think there's anything to the south here. Did I talk to you? Did you plan on going... Yeah, I knew... Okay, yeah, I did talk to you. Well, I know there's a door to the right as well. Alright, there's Princess Lady. Not the princess, she just goes on about princesses. But anyway, we can go in here. And we have a couple of places we can go. I can remember several years ago when this town was bustling. Many contractors from a town called Izmit set temporary homes here. They were building something somewhere nearby. Oh, am I going to go to Izmit? 
nothing in the uh, nothing in the drawers. And over here, lady. Green lad, that just sounds easy to be but you need to get there by ship. Alright, and that looks like all the doors we can find. If there's any more in town, I'll show them. But otherwise, I'll meet you in Reeve. Alright, welcome back to Reeve. We have a door that we could open here. What you got? If you journey east and go over the mountains, you will find a small lake. That's... that's nice, sir. Uh, that's the kid that... Kid that has different music playing in his apartment. With, unfortunately, no, uh, parents. Oh, mm. uh, yeah, it looks like that's all the doors other than this one. Let's go ahead in. Uh, anything good? Nah. And again, he likes to play the same music as the orphan. That's lovely. Okay. People who cross the distant seas are surely wait waiting and hoping for a hero to emerge. I've been told I could be one. Well, of course you could, darling. Why don't you start by becoming a local hero first? To the east is a travel door. Since his destination had no civilization for miles, the king had it walled off as a mean of, of defense. However, a new passenger tunnel to Endor has opened near the other side. Oh, that's that shrine to the north in Branca. That makes sense. Also, I don't know if my... I think my computer just made a noise, but whatever. Quick access to Endor will benefit this country's trade once the travel door becomes available again. Break the seal with this. Hopefully we'll pick up a party member. Maybe Celeste will join us again? <laughs> she seems to be joining everybody. Oh, wait a second. In these parts, even the small task will test your courage. Oh, okay. Alright, let's go to the right. It's just straight east from here. I already saved off screen, so let's do it. I'll be editing out battles, though. And by edit, I mean pausing through. Because I have bad editing skills. That's why I did this. We gotta get to that water lake to the right. <sighs> that fight was annoying. A bunch of people putting me to sleep. Uh, we have a shrine in that water area. Of course, we'll check out the shrine first. Nothing in there. I don't think I have room anyway. How's our health? Eh, that were okay enough. Oh, oh, young lady, do you have the magic ball? No. That's out of the question. Go back at once. Uh, yes. You must use it in the cave of enticement secluded at the edge of the spring. Uh, wait. Say that again. In the cave of enticement secluded at the edge of the spring. Okay, okay, okay. I want to make sure it wasn't like something different than normal. Ooh, this is going to be a bit of a trek, too. We go in here. The dungeon here is pretty bad. Well, by bad, I mean it takes a bit. Hmm, not much else here. Alright. Are we going to have wild battles before we even get over there? Yes, we are! I'm going to show this one off, because this should be easy enough. Also, I'm lazy. Alright, so we need to fight this babble first. No way, man. Let's talk to this old man. This is the cave enticement, but the stairway is sealed off by a stone wall. So we go here, select the magic ball. It fits in the wall. Ta-da! Let me talk to the old man again. After all these years, the seal has been broken! Yes, it has. Woohoo! Let's go down those stairs and see what's going on. Oh. Yeah, this place is annoying. One second. Okay, I was pulling up a map. And I... Because I, otherwise, I'd be getting lost forever. Alright, so we're going to go up here. I probably didn't need to pause that one, but whatever. We're going to go up here, then go straight left. Uh, wait, is left better? Actually, left is longer. We can actually go up and right. May as well. Alright, then go up and left. Okay, here. Ooh. 
Yeah, any any battle with those rabbits, is, you have to, uh, I have to pause it. But okay, we go, we're gonna go out here. And for our treasure chest, we go left here. It's nothing special, if I remember right. Yeah, just an antidote herb, but I got the chest. Anyway, you want to go right. The other places are just loops or dead ends. And not this down. But this down is the way you want to go. It's a long way all the way down. Uh, yeah, if I didn't have this, I'd be wandering around lost like hell. Seriously, when I first played the game, that's how I always got lost here. Okay, it's just one. If it puts us to sleep, though, yeah. Thank you, Tov. That's what can make the fight just last too long. Alright, from here, left is a dead end. So go up. And if we want a treasure chest, we go left. I just say no to moths. Game, I said I say no to moths. That was the second moth battle only, again. Uh, jeez. Uh, let's... Heal up, I guess. The antidote herb is gonna be worth its weight in gold if I get poisoned. A magic knife! I don't think it's as powerful. It is better if I want to use my hurt spell, but that's about it. Anyway, we want to head back over. No moths mean no moths, game. Jeez, that's a third one. Let's go left. And there'll be a staircase up this way. At least it wasn't moths this time. It was babbles. Oh! Huh. That's kind of neat and different. I guess, uh... Oh, that makes sense if I want to do a quick back to Reva and such. I appreciate that. Alright, now this one. The center and the rightmost are dead ends. So, let's go left. There was some stairs we passed some earlier. I'm gonna show this part off. And, uh... It just led to the basement with nothing of redeemable value in there. It's just where you would fall in if you fell into one of those black parts. Let's go this way. And this will take us to the next part. Uh, just one. I just really want to find a uh, partner. And then maybe I'll go back and explore to make sure that every blank spot is actually blank. Well, I need a partner that can hold items. That's really what I need. Alright. Yes, this is the spot just above where uh, I had my Mara and Nara pop in. Hmm, not much here. Alright, there's this shrine up here. Not much up there. Things are going to get a little tougher here, probably. Well, there's that guy, old guy. The one that's technically polite. I'm just checking here, because normally there would be seeds here. I don't think I checked there with um, Maya and Maya. And I keep saying Maya and Mina because I'm used to their new translation now, but no, Mara and Nara. Hi, doggy. I have a doggy too. Mine looks more like a wolf, but still. Hey, oh, you lost. This is my shot. Looks so gloomy. I hate gloomy kids. All right, stay here tonight if you want to. Are you going to sleep forever? Get out of here. You can go west towards Endor. Alright. Wait a second. Why don't you take the things from the, those jaws in that room? Come here, boy. Ah, You can go west towards Endor. Thank you. I don't have room. Hmm. Yeah, I literally just don't have room. I'm going to have to dip out on the antidote herb. Money. Leather armor. Party can't carry one more item. Uh, Wing of Wyvern, then. I could always buy that again. And a medical herb. <laughs> okay. That was a downgrade. Let's see. Uh, a leather armor. I don't think... I don't know if I'm ready to equip anything heavier yet. Let's see. By how much? Four more defense? Nah. It has to be a much higher amount before I'm going to get rid of the dancer's costume. I like the little boost I have to uh, to my hurt spell. But alright, I think we'll just go right to Endor. I'm not going to dick around like I usually do. 
So let's go down to the left. And I'll show off, I guess, one fight. Oh, oh these are less hard, actually. These are not that bad. I'm gonna go use the hurt spell, though. Thank you. If I used, if I was equipping the magic knife with me, I would probably have be able to one shot some of these guys with hurt. But nah, I don't feel like switching around that much. What do you got? Okay, let's do a hurt spell again. I just want to get these over with. But I do love that. Okay. Nope, this is familiar. May this total lead people to their dreams. I wish you good luck on your journey. Hey, you. What a great map. This guy is still here. Okay. Let's talk to this old fella. Is he going to say the same thing as he said to my Mara and R? Damn. You have me to do? Yep. Alright, to Endor, and hopefully we will find ourselves a new party member. I'm hoping. No battles noise. Wait, what? That's a... That was a weird noise. I didn't do anything. Okay. This guy still doesn't know what to do with their shop. But that was a weird random uh, noise. Is the... The casino's here! Welcome to the casino. Only coins can be used here. Please purchase coins from the coin seller in the back. Hmm. And there's this random dude. Alright, double or nothing. I now have 16 coins instead of 8. I'm hooked! Good for you. You can exchange your coins with the guy. Yes, thank you. I'm out of luck today. I might do some safe scumming for this. No, oh, my day's wages are gone! I don't have nearly enough money to be gambling with all that. How are you doing? Winning? No. Luck may come soon. Wait it out, okay? Well, I just wasn't winning because, yeah, I haven't started. Get the inside scoop. Nah. Yeah, I'm not doing the monster uh, one yet. But, okay. At least it's open. Why don't I go wandering about? Like, maybe say hi to uh, Taloon's wife here. Not in this place alone. I had to change the business model. Yeah, you're still the storage person now. Uh... What about you? I haven't seen my friend Celeste in a while. Hope she's okay. Oh. Yeah, that ain't good. Though I guess I could might be able to catch up with Mara and Nara. Haven't seen Celeste in a while, though? Hmm. I'm surprised Celeste wasn't going out and trying to get stuff for, uh... For Netta. What do you have to say now? It's hopeless. The prophecy was wrong. No one can stand in Baramos's way now. Oh. Congratulations. <laughs> that seems a little... <laughs> Off-putting. Oh, joy. The two kingdoms will live in harmony now. Okay, you're still on about the wedding. I'm gonna go ahead and sell my magic knife. And my leather armor. Very good. Hmm. If anything's changed, I'll I'll just jump cut to it, because uh, I don't want to just have you watch me just wander about. So, be right back. Here's some new dialogue. Not too long ago, Paramus' forces headed out toward the lion, but no one knew why. Soon after, I heard that the hero who was supposed to take him down had died. Yeah. Alright. Next new thing. Alright. This is one place where we can go in. Because we have the silver key on Endor. So let's see. This is a shop, isn't it? I'm here because I heard the shop has many unique goods. All right. How bad and expensive is it in this game? Is it the same as what it is in the original or something different? It's the same. We have the Cloak of Evasion, the Sword Edge armor, which is basically just spiked armor, reflects physical damage, and the Metal Babble armor. 15,000 gold! <laughs> it's gonna be a while before I can earn that up, but... Alright, something to shoot for. I appreciate that it's here. 
There's also a couple other doors like that in, uh, in the middle of Endor, so we may as well go ahead and grab it. If we go this way... Wait, am I thinking the right place? No, 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 I'm sorry. Wrong spot. Oh wait, actually they could work too. There's a couple side doors like that too. But there's also one over here. I hopefully it's the same. Yes, it is. We go up here. Oh, this is a lot. Hi, dude. The sky looks ominous. I'm afraid the new ruler of evil might make his presence known. Anything good on the bookshelf? No. And now we're on top of the tower for absolutely no reason. I'll just meet you at the bottom. Well, this is different. This is the king of Endor's chamber. Our king is at the wedding. Oh, so the wedding's on right now. Cool. Does that mean I can... I can go in his bedroom, but this... This lady's gonna be blocking our way for a bit until... Until nightfall. But then after night, I can grab some unique items. This is the dressing room of the king and princess. It sure is. Wanna move? Come on, you know you do. <laughs> nah, she's not gonna. I'll have to just remember to come back at night. But it does mean I have to sneak in. Anyway, I'll meet you on the side part of the castle, where the wedding is, but also some doors. Okay, I took the left side, and right here. We have a little side door. Unfortunately, it looks like they do nothing of the sort that matters, anyway. Mm, I was hoping that I'd be able to get behind that, uh, the secret shop or something. Anyway. A royal wedding is taking place inside. You're not on the guest list, so go find something else to do. Oh, no wedding for us. I was kind of hoping. All right, I'll just jump on out real quick. Uh, so there is no obvious party member here. I'm going to wait till it's nighttime and then go loot the place still. How's my inventory? Oh, God, I wasn't talking to you. How's my inventory? I have room. So I'll see you at nighttime. Okay, nighttime. It's time to loot. Also, they're on their honeymoon now. Papa, I'm sorry. Mia, I love you. King, want to move out of the way? Please. Thank you. You need a new place to sleep. <laughs> yeah, that'd be awkward, wouldn't it? Especially if they decide to consummate the marriage. Ah, small metal. All right, we could pass that out. Over. I'm gonna use the medical herb. Just get rid of it. We obtained a feather hat. We already have that. I can't carry one more item. God damn it. Uh, the basic clothes can don't give enough money anyway. And a pink leotard. I think that's actually a suitable amount of defense. Yeah, 27 defense. Yeah, that's definitely worth getting rid of the dancer's costume over. Nice. Awesome, we got a nice free armor upgrade. That's what I was looking for. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna check out Lakanaba and see if there's anything new and interesting there too, because I'm in the area. May as well. Oh, and one other fun thing. I have the return spell now. Am I gonna bump my head? No. Yeah, Endor, Bonmalmo, and Reeve. So, I can go back and forth as I need to. I'm probably going to try to keep Reeve on my list, so uh, I'll probably use that and then come back here and then... Whatever. You don't need to know my process. I'll meet you in Lakanaba if there's anything interesting. Otherwise, I'll meet you back in the shrine where we last saw my... my uh, damn it. Mara and Nara go. Alright, so I'm in Lakanaba and something different here is happening. The guy finally figured out his... his shop. Wanna buy something? If you want weapons, go to the shop upstairs. Um, go on the other side of the counter if you want to do business. <laughs> it's like, hey, don't mind me. I'm just gonna go invade your, invade the back counter. No, no problem there, right? Hey, equipment shop. If you look over, you get a poison whip, gold axe, and sword of justice. The sword of justice looks interesting. But watch it be a bunch of junk anyway. But. I like also like the idea of the poison whip too. That's kind of fun. 
but I don't have any money for that, so we're gonna say no to that. And, uh, let's see. Who lives here now? Hey, a young couple here. A merchant and his wife sold us this house. I do love a quiet house. My daughter works at the wedding shop. Well, very good. And what do we have around here? Hey, dude. John went to find honest work. He grabbed his dog and took off once the new tunnel was finished. Oh, look. That damn dog is back. Is dog okay? <laughs> I figured he'd have something different to, different to say. But yeah, there's not much else to be done here. Unfortunately. I was kind of hoping... Wait, do you say anything new? It yeah, will save the world now. Okay. Doom and gloom. Got it. But that's it for Lakanaba. Hmm. I wonder, what happens if I go in that portal nearby? Let's find out. So this is previously Foxville, and they made a portal here for Tornico. I think this takes us to... Oh, Tantacle. That's different. Hmm. I was expecting Mightenhall for some reason, but no, I mixed them up. Uh, get a Silver Heart, blah blah blah. West is Tentacle, and yeah. Well, what happens when we go here? Are enemies going to be way too hard for me? They might be. Can I reach them? Alright, that's not the worst. I mean, I do have advanced armor with that uh, fucking leotard. <laughs> Let's try going to call. Uh, more new enemies. I'm just showing them all right now because I want to see if I, we can make it through. But it looks like we can. These guys resist hurt pretty well. Yeah, they do. I do about the same damage as my spell now. I don't have the, uh... I was just looking over myself. But it's not like I have, um... The dancer's costume giving me that boost to magic attack anymore. So I'm sure that's not... That's not, uh... Helping the matters. Oh god, ghosts. No. No. Ghosts are a pain in the ass. If I get a little closer to call, I'm okay with that. And... Alright, I'm gonna try the Hurt spell. Good hit. It fizzled? Ugh! I don't have enough MP now. Yeah, these things can possess you. But we've only had that happen once, and it happened to Tob, funny enough. A leather hat? I've got something better, and I can't tell what the drop item special qualities are, so... What is going here? Dreadful is the something content takes great skill and wit to get there. Hmm. I wonder if I didn't save Christo, if I could try and save him with the bluette now. I doubt it would work, but you know. You're gonna tell me about rheumatism or whatever? Yeah. Well, I can open this door now, not that it matters. <laughs> Anything else of note? Endor has a new bridge and a tunnel. I'm jealous. Holy, real bait, really. Really brave or really crazy people go through our tunnel. You have anything new to say? Do you hear what my flute can do? No. Trying someone who's been turned to stone, that's the... That's the same thing as before. Hmm. Not much of note here. Not right now, anyway. I don't think I could buy anything if I really wanted to, anyway, but... I like the idea that, uh... I could just go here. What I think I'm going to end up doing, however, is just returning over to Endor, go to the shrine, and pick up some party members so I can hold things. Because while I'm sure I can do a lot of... Well, I gotta, I gotta first go to the inn. But I'm, while I'm sure that I could do a lot of fun travels and maybe finding some new treasures, I think Call has a few. Ooh. Nah, I can't get in there. Uh, while I'm sure I... There's some good new treasures I could get. I need inventory space. So, that's what I'm going to focus on next. I will meet you back in Endor, I guess. And I'll head toward the shrine. Actually, I'll just meet you at the... At the shrine that I left Ma me, uh, Mara, and Nara. 
Alright guys, so... Before we go to... Pick up uh, Mara and Nara, or at least go where they we last saw them... I decided to go ahead and gamble! What I did was I bought... I bought 20 tokens for 20... Well... For a, a thousand gold, so I'm, I am down a little bit of money. But... I then gambled on the... I was going to say on the casino. Yeah, because, you know, that's that's what you gamble in the casino on. On the casino. You gamble right on top of it. No. The slot machines. Uh, I was gambling on the slot machines for a while because it's the cheapest thing you could pay out with. And it can pay up to about 1,000 gold... Uh, 1,000 coins. And once I got the... Tokens, excuse me. Once I got about 1,000 tokens, I then switched over to video poker for a bit. Then I went to the monster betting arena and save scummed until I got a couple deep wins in... Now, I have about 4,000 coins. Yeah, yeah, not that much, but I could afford a meteorite armband if I really wanted to. I'm not going to, because I'm going to save up for the metal battle shield. That, that's definitely 100% what I want to get, at least one of. I don't know if I'll be, I don't think I'll be getting it anytime soon. I'm not going to waste my time just going over and over to save scum until I got it. I could, but I'd rather get some party members in, preferably find a merchant if I can. So I can identify each thing, because, like, I want to go over some of these things. Like, one, like, we know what a magic potion is. That's simple enough. Restores your MP. Barag Skull? What the f What is that supposed to be? I would like a merchant to let me know. Wizard Ring? We know that. We've gotten one. It helps with some magic, but it also can help with uh, recovering your MP. Sphere of Spellcast? I think we found one over in... I think this is the one that we found in Mara Nara's chapter that uses your MP as a weapon. It's sort of like, basically, magic burst in a, but as a usable item, using your MP. I don't know what the hell Birdsong Nectar's doing in here, though. That's a little weird. Maybe it's something that cures silence, I guess? Who knows? I'll find out again when I get Tornico to join. Meteor Armband, we already have one. But if I do find myself needing another, I know where to get it. No idea what the hell Trail Mix is. If it's that much, though, I would hope it's not just a usable item, unless it's something, like, that revives everybody. And the Metal Babble Shield just sounds good. So, I just wanted to show off that before I head on over. So, now let's go ahead and take the tunnels over to, uh, see Mara and Nara's little camp that they had. See you there. Alright, while going through the teleportal, I found a random dude going in around in here. We're on a small island in the North Altair... Altarthian Sea. Many people think this is the Isle of Greenland, but Greenland is the larger island north of here. Good to know. I just wanted to show that off because that's something different. And to show off where we are. Yeah, we're j it's basically like the Iceland versus Greenland thing. So, anyway, we gotta go through the tunnel. I don't know how we're gonna do it, but we're gonna try. Wish us luck. Never mind. I just realized, we have the door! <laughs> that is just hilarious, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like, hey, here, have a quick way out of here. I'm still probably gonna have to fight something, so why don't I show it? Oh, uh, we got a golden barrette. Uh, can you equip that? I think that it'll break though, but... Let's see. Increase your defense by a lot, yeah. I think you need it. It'll probably break, but let's go for it. Can we get through? How did we do that? Okay, well, that was easier than I thought, but that was also hilarious. I forgot about that. Well, what's up? Another lost soul looking for a safe heaven. Would you like to have your fortune told? No. May your journey be filled with good fortune, then. Alright, alright. Enough dicking around. Yes. You are... Hmm. You are a complex one, indeed. I lost everyone I've ever known. I need to find my father, but I can't do it alone. I wish I could read you, but whatever it is in that aura of yours is quite powerful. We, too, are lost at the moment. Perhaps it would be best for all of us to travel together. Mara! Huh? What? It is time to go. We have someone to travel with. And just like that, we have Mara and Nara in our party. And 
t we still have Tom. Awesome. Let's check over our inventory. They still had a lot. Uh, we had the silver scales and the sprite satchel. Maybe blue can do anything with the sprite satchel. What does it do? Hmm. Yeah, nope. He can't do anything with it. No idea what it does still, but, well, we have it. You have the silver scales and Mr. S and the Mr. Mystic Clock. Can't give it. Can you use it? No runes are present. Still got that. Okay. Silver scales. Golden claw. You still have the golden claw. That's cool. Give that to Blue. I doubt she could use it, but we could see. Can I... Yeah, okay. So she's locked in with the gold key. I'm going to try having Blue check out... Check have everything here. Uh, let's see. Fairy water, iron fan. Yeah, that's about everything here. Alright, just checking real quick. Nah. It was worth a shot. Alright, so let me see. If I go down there, that's just the bottom of their, the castle that they came from. Kileon. There is a... Somehow, we have to get over to here where there is a rune, but we... Don't know how to get through this forest yet. It's a little weird, but it was what we found out when when we got the firefly flute. Now that I have them, though, I assume I can just go to Call and uh, try exploring around there. Now that I have the magic key and maybe the, some of the uh, bridges are are fixed. Who knows? I think that's where I'm gonna go. Let me see. But I am gonna check to see if the uh, there was a flood that was blocking off a part of here before when I was playing as Mara and Nara. And I want to see if that place is still there. So I'm going to check that out off screen. But if not, if it's not there, I will show you guys over to Call. Okay, I'm in Remolder now. And, uh, yep, we can open these doors. Let's talk to this old man. I'm telling you, Nesta, the fairy flew four steps south of the bath in Call. I already got it, though, so... Return? We got a wing of wyvern? Really? That's all we got for that? That's lame. Uh, well, we have that. We have Simulder. Hmm, we haven't checked out that yet. I think that's all the silver key doors that we can get here. By the way, the, the bridge to Tentacle is still broken, so we can't do much for it. I could check the shop, though, one more time to see if anything different's changed. I don't think so. It said it's a hardware store at during the day, and at night it's a specialty shop, but the specialty shop never was open. It just it was like, oh, hey, here's some information that you didn't ask for. And that's always what it was. So let's see. I hear this big dragon. Yep, yeah, that's the sale of the same. Hmm. Well, what I could do is... Oh, actually, it's easier to just do this. What I could do is go check out some older. I mean, I don't think we can take the enemies there, but uh, I could see if there's something else going on down there. Let's find out. Wait a second, I just realized something. The crypt is open now. That's what, that's what they call it. If you wish to tackle the, in the catacombs. Sorry, the catacombs. Ah, that sounds like something we could try. Uh, you're still saying the same thing. And I have a shop here. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna rest up, maybe upgrade some equipment, and, uh, save. Then let's see what the catacombs has to offer. I assume it's gonna be bad, but I'll show off the bad, because, well, I'll have saved anyway. So, I'll be right back. Okay, I did some of my upgrades, and I think we're good. Here's what I got. I decided to give uh, Blue the Morning Star. It's a up pure upgrade to the Chain Sickle, but also still has a long range, so she can still do some attack. And I downgraded slightly to the Common Robe for her because it'll increase her magic attack a little bit while only being like five defense less than a pink Leotard. I'm still holding on to the Leotard in case it has some sort of innate abilities in it that I'm not aware of, because like the Common Robe, you wouldn't expect to get boost your magic attack, but you never know. The pink Leotard might have some bonuses that I'm not aware of. So, I figured, you know what, we'll keep it just in case. As for 
Nara, I decided to keep her on what she has. The common robe would be an upgrade, but the fur coat protects it from cold, and I like the idea of having some protection items on them. So for now, we're going to leave that. Also, you may have noticed I didn't give a shield to Blue because I'd rather only give her a shield if she can get some sort of resistance out of it. Sort of like the scale shield for fire. I think that's what I would like to do with for her for the shields, because right now her defense is pretty good. So, no worries. For Mara, I just... Whoop. I just completely upgraded her uh, dancer's costume to common robe because the only thing the dancer's costume had over the common robe was like a little bit more max MP, but I think that's very negligible. So I'd rather just go ahead and give her the extra boost to magic attack and defense, and more importantly, the actual defense you get out of it. So that's our upgrades. I already saved, and now let's see what this does. We have Basilisks. I'm sure they're going to be way out of our league. Let's find out. Uh, I'm going to go with Drain right away. Petrifies a bit. Oh, wow. We were able to just get them. Fairy water is... Okay, Petrify didn't stay. Good, good, good. Let's see what we can do. I just went with Drain right away, just in case they were, like, super high level. Okay, these are the enemies that appear right outside. Alright. This is a bit of a motley crew. I'm gonna use Hurt and Drain again. All we have to do is survive. Hmm. That's actually not the worst damage. Was she cursed? No, she just weakened. Okay. Well, let's get, let's just try this out. All right, a single dragonfly. Not too bad. And again, I'm showing the battles for this because this should be exciting. Um, this is a case where I want you just attacking, and I'm gonna have you try frost because it's a dragonfly. Fifty-two damage. Nice. I'm gonna mark that in. I have a little spreadsheet telling me what enemies are weak to what, or at least what works. So let me put dragon, space, fly. And there we go. Yeah, I'm keeping track of all this just to make it easier for my mage, mages, uh, keeping track of them. Oh, that's a lot. Let's do the spread damage again. Level up to 13 on that. Ow. That was weak, unfortunately. She's better off attacking. Good to know. Alright, not the worst. Are we, any permanent status effects? No. Also, defense-wise, 42, 58, 62. Nara probably should be leading, but oh well. Alright, the mummies aren't the issue. It's the Gorgon that I don't know much about. So why don't I try a blaze first on it? I'm not sure what the petrified does. All right, Gorgon is a, not going to be affected by that. Let's go ahead and attack the mummies, and why don't you frost up the Gorgon? All right, they're immune to ice and resistant to fire. So we'll try Zap next. Let's see if they're just immune to all magic or not. Yeah, wow! That ain't good. Alright, in that case, why don't you... Does anyone need healing? No. Regular attack for now. Why don't you try sapping them? Huh, that didn't work. I could try running, probably would be better at this point. Why don't you... the kill. You try sapping one more time. Really? Stop fizzling! Okay. Oh god, really? Man, this is not looking good. Wow, what a piece of shit. I'm gonna run. I'm running. You're not, they're not, this is not worth it. 
Plus, I don't know if that Petrify is going to do something worse, so... We'll just keep going. Alright, mummies are no problem. And again, I'm just going to show these off for now. Uh, they have no magic, so just attack. Uh, the Two of Swords only does a little bit of a boost. I figured out the way the cards work is they have one of four boosts or debuffs that could happen. And uh, the, the amount it boosts or decreases based on the value of the card. So, you know, an ace would be, like, uh, your best. A two would be your worst. Alright, Voodoo Shaman. You guys just attack, and why don't you try Rob Magicking? Doesn't seem like the fight, the, the battles are super threatening at the moment, though. Alright, one more Rob Magic should do it. Because you can only... You can only Rob Magic a few times... Uh, before, and they it kind of go, di what is it, as diminishing returns as the turns go on. So, you have to do it the first round, and you'll get a pretty good uh, chunk of MP. But after that, it's pretty low. Um, do you have anything you could use? I probably should have bought the magic wand, the wizard's wand in, uh, in Simulator, but oh well. Keep attacking. There you go. A little rough, but that, not the worst. Alright, um... We're gonna go right. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna start skipping battles, I think, because this is gonna get repetitive, so I'll be right back. Alright, that fight's done. We're gonna go left. And it's a dead end, of course. Alright, exit out of there. Let's keep going to the right. Actually, this is a unique enemy, so I kind of want to show it off. Let's see. Um, can you rob magic from it? Does it have any magic? Nah. I'm trying... She doesn't have much MP left, so it's like, uh, I need to start robbing magic. Why don't you... Ooh, wait. Why don't you use your hurt spell? I just want to make sure I have enough for an outside. After that, it's not a big deal, but... Let's try hurt. And... Hmm. Yeah, I wish I... One of these did something in battle. Just keep attacking, and yeah, try rob magic one more time. All right. Hmm. Hurt doesn't do much damage. Is it like one of those uh, what was it called? Uh, metal scorpions, where it has a really good defense here. Here, why don't you? Use heal on top, which will heal to blue. There you go. I think we're going to have to give up on this one, probably, because we... I don't want to use the MP... Oh, okay, there. Finally. Jeez, that was annoying. Okay. Yeah. I, I need to find a magic caster. Let's go down. It's a dead end. Sorry, I just realized. Magic caster! You two attack, and you just rob magic. You know, one other thing I could do, technically, is have uh, Mara rob magic from her allies if she needs really needs the MP. But I, we all could use our magic, so... <laughs> That'd be kind of self-defeating. I imagine it's going to run away after a while. Oh, okay, we got him. And Mara got some decent MP. Alright. Let's head on up. And see what this is going to be. Eh, it's just a hork. Okay. Oh, we got some stairs. Oh, those are new enemies, but the Terror Shadow honestly scares me. Alright. You focus down that. I think this is a time for a drain. Yeah, we gotta go all out. Thank you for stunning the two dangerous ones there. Okay, we really got uh, got to get rid of him. See if you can rob any magic from him just a little bit. No, oh, it fizzled. All right, yeah, that that drain definitely helped. I'm tempted to go down, but first, oh, damn it! Really? I just ran away from them. I want to look down. Let's 
to the right. Nothing. Uh, Gorgon. Um, they're basically immune to everything. Actually, I'm gonna just go ahead and steal some magic and uh, pause. Yeah, I had to run. Alright, let's see over here then. Wait, did I even go inside there? I'll do it off screen just in case I did. But we have a Skeletar! This is new. Um, hmm. Thinking how I want to do this. I don't want to use up her MP. I used up a lot already. Let's see, why don't we try Rob Magic, see if it has any. Ooh, it did! And we got a good amount. And Tob just as like said no. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna make sure I looked in there or not, because my memory's starting to fry here. Okay, you may notice that we're hurt a little bit. Uh, and also, yes, I did check that room. It was dead end. Let's go down and see what else is here before we go back to those stairs, I guess. I'm guessing this is gonna be a dead end. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna heal up here. I'll be right back. Alright, we're heading down. I managed to heal up a little bit. Let's try left. I just ran away from that. Oh, God. Okay, we're still going. And a magical mutation. I still don't know what that really means. Uh, but I think we're just probably going to run away in the end. But So I'll be right back. I ended up beating it up, thanks to Tov. But what's up here? Mummies, that's what it is. But they are off guard, so we're running away. This feels familiar. I feel like I'm going in a circle, though. Ah, oh, and they suddenly attacked. I'll... Yeah, I'll be right back. I'm probably gonna have to run away from this, too. I don't know when I uh, paused and unpaused there, so... But I managed to beat the gremlin, so yay! If you didn't know what I'm talking about, don't worry about it. Ugh, Terror Shadow. Well, I'm stealing up a lot of MP. Also, this hallway does feel a little bit familiar. Another one? Oh, and here's another staircase. And... Did I just go backwards? Is that what happened? Really? Huh. Well, I can survive in there, so that's good. I'm gonna see if I can get back to that other staircase that we found, and I'll meet you there. I knew that looked familiar, though. So, let me go ahead and rest up. At least I got some... Of, I looked around all the nooks and crannies already. But, actually, looking at the time, this is actually not a bad time to end the recording. It's been about an hour. I have to do some stitching together because I did take a day break in between some of these. But uh, I'm trying to keep these within an hour. And so, yeah, next time we'll go exploring a little bit more. I hate cutting it off like that. I usually like to have it more set up. But oh well. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.